So I'm gonna fish a short stretch of river. I'm catching a bunch today. Kind of stinks lugging the camera around. So I'm just gonna fish just a real short stretch. See as many as I can catch real quick. My setup is I'm fishing a 10 and a half foot two weight Cortland Nymph rod, really nice rod. And I'm fishing a simple waltz worm on the bottom and a Frenchie on top. I'm gonna rotate between weights of flies, maybe a 2.5, 2.8, 3.0, depending on how much volume of water and what I need to do. The stretch I'm gonna fish is really fast. I don't know if the, the vocals, the audio will be okay and how fast the water is. Um, so a lot of it, I'm gonna get really close because the fish won't spook as close as I need, as I can get. And I'll be able to make better drifts closer and be able to fish more under my rod tip. Um, hope you enjoy. I'm gonna fish this inside edge first. Let's see if there's a fish there. On the other side, over there, looks like a likely spot. I'm gonna fish a three millimeter and see if I can get one over in there. fish sitting in that. See, like a spot like this over here, we can get really close because we're most likely not going to spook the fish. And getting closer, you're just going to make a better drift with a better angle with a closer rod over top of where you're going to drift at. It's going to slow the fly down, give you better connection, better strike detection, better reaction time. So if you want to fish in the south, midwest, I don't really know where we are, Oklahoma, uh, I recommend fishing this river, it's really awesome. Uh, Lower Mountain Fork, Spillway Creek, 
awesome fish. Caught a nice little palomino earlier today. A bunch of good fish here. A lot of good access, public land. We're in a state park, Beaver's Bend State Park. I hope you enjoy, have a great day.